Hello YouTubers. Today we are going to look at a classic American firearm. It's a peacemaker from Colt. Look at this beautiful piece of history. This one is a 7.5 inch barrel model. It also comes with a 22 long rifle cylinder, which is fluted. The one that have on the frame right now is the 22 Magnum. I love shooting 22 Magnum. It's a powerful cartridge. Underrated in my personal opinion. And this one is the smaller scale of the famous core single action. Look at how nice the grip is. Got a pouncing pony. And the uh, American Eagle. Case Hardin, Case Harden steel and aluminum grip frame. So this revolver is light. And of course all steel barrel. Beautiful blue in just beautiful blue that you don't see this blue anymore these days. This one is safe to carry with one empty chamber on the hammer. So if you carry this one, make sure you only put in five for safety reasons. Let's listen to it. C O L T. Definitely a cold. Let's try the trigger. Look at this nice, somewhat flat trigger. It's very thin though. Definitely less than three pounds. Very crisp. No take up, no resistance. If you are looking for a target shooter, you'll be disappointed though, because the advantage of this one is lightweight and it's smaller size. Make it a harder pistol to shoot accurately. And I find it more difficult to shoot it with both hands than just shoot it like old cowboy style with one hand. And I think that's the way this pistol revolver is supposed to be shoot is to shoot it one handed. Just cock the hammer one hand and then shoot it with one hand. See how wheel is very firmly lock up. 
is uh, produced by coat from early 1970 to 1977. I think in my personal opinion this is a great opportunity to collect this pistol still inexpensively right now for you to collect but in the future I think this one has the room to run on the price just because it's a 22 long rifle caliber and given the political climate right now maybe you know 10 20 years from now on you can only shoot 22 I hope that doesn't come to the case to be but uh, who knows you know it's a very nicely made coat pistol and it's discontinued with the labor cost right now and the shortage of the workmanship probably cost two thousand dollars to produce a gun like this in United States and that's why the best replica right now in my opinion is the Uberti from Italy because there they can still make it possible in terms of match the quality of these Odis to the price we can afford but right now let's just look at it enjoy the beauty of it and take it out to shoot once for a while and pass it on to our children and grandchildren so they understand once upon a time there's a beautiful American history like this the old westerns the availability and popularity of 22 long rifle an American true American cartridge but don't get me wrong you can shoot this thing as often and as much as you want for me I'm not going to do it probably take it out once for a while just shoot three or four wheels that's it and I got very lucky for this one I also got a box to match look at that old box inside there is a manual and everything else and let's compare the two cartridges the one on my left hand is 22 long rifle the one on my right hand is a 22 magnum look at the big difference huge difference but you know what you don't have to choose for this guy he got you cover both
kind of old style iron sight. This is definitely an actionable item for you. If you see one on the counter, you should grab it. If you are a revolver fan and a die hard 22 long rifle fan, you should not miss this. Cold Peacemaker. Where the revolver is, is where the peace is. So long, safe shooting.